Hello there, everyone. I am Zelda Nitrous, and welcome back to another episode of Spire of the Dragon. Uh, in the last episode, we kind of had a little bit of conflict, but you know, it's it's all good. Now. Oh darn! That, that guy was, you know, quivering in in fear, but oh my gosh, oh my gosh, they do the most silliest thing ever once they're once I turn my back. Hi, Spyro! Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. I like that dragon. I like the way he talks. It's funny. Later on he's gonna be like, you make a fun of the way I talk. I'm like, ah! Alright, so let's go into Ice Cavern. Which is... Um, to be honest, once I was a little girl, and once I played this, I had nightmares about this stage. Like, there was always a secret here. Some secret was here. And you had to glide around it. And there was, but I didn't know at the time because I was a little girl, and here they are. Three lives. I think you want to for one people don't have- Wait, what?! Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Who said that? That was rude! I'm sorry. <laughs> oh boy, I'm gonna get so trolled. <laughs> I'm seriously gonna get trolled alone. But, I don't care! Hey, I'm over here. <gasps> oh, don't, don't, don't jump, don't jump. Here comes another old timer. Asher. Thank you for releasing me! Oh, <laughs> uh, these elders are... You, you naughty little boy! Oh, naughty, I swear! Alright, those gems I will save for later. Look at these atomic bombs! Oh, they're done. Oh my gosh, I remember back when... You know, my boyfriend. Or my my friend Kevin. Oh yeah, if you're wondering why I just call my friend now. We had to break up. I know. I was crying my eyes out. I'm like, ah! Oh, <laughs> that's stuff. And I bet he was too. I don't care how macho he is. He was crying too. But yeah, he's gonna be moving to a different state soon for college, and well, I don't want to stop him from you know, achieving his dream. So, which I sometimes wonder what it is. I think he wants to be in you know graphic design, and because he loves to, you know, he's still doing his best. He wants to learn to you know make all these pictures or edit or edit photos and all that stuff. He, he really likes that stuff. Or you know, use his voice a lot too, because you know how much of a very good voice actor he is. He's just, <laughs> he's just funny as hell. Yeah, just funny as hell. <sighs> he also been trailer quest. Holy crap, that would be better. Cause imagine. Oh, wait, oh god, that would be bad too. He would, he would be throwing his voice wherever the hell it shouldn't be going. <laughs> or shouldn't be coming out of. Just imagine a freaking dog talking to you. <laughs> dog cons. Yeah, whatever. Ragnar. You've done well, Spyro. Some dragons thought you weren't ready, but I knew they were wrong. I'm ready, alright. Ready for what? And that mystery will be remained unsolved. Alright, so let's go on back <sighs> Darn, I forgot about that. Alright. Take that! I like that little sound they make when they die. Or when you kill them. Your death amuses me. Why? Because it gets a little jingle! That sounds like something off of a bicycle. Oh my gosh, that is so... Oh my god. That reminds me of something that Ahmed said off of, um... 
depth on him about the blue Prius. Oh! Thank you for releasing me. Yes! Yes! The news reported dragons! The new the anchor dragon. <laughs> anchor dragons. That's what I call them because they sound like an anchor man or a radio announcer. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I gotta get my friend Kevin to hear this. But then again, he already knows because he did a let's play of it back then and I think he still did and he just loves the anchor man dragon. Oh, it's freaking. Oh. Oh, my friend! Which friend is it? He is my Call of Duty friend. And he's the good player. I beat him one day. Uh, he's good when it comes to player matches, but there's only one game where I beat him in it. And that was it. After all, I've just been getting close or not. Also, my friend, uh, Andrew. Andrew, the Master Elhart. He's a pretty damn good Call of Duty Black Ops player. He's he's a beast with the ballistic knif knifs. Why did I say knifs? Because it's just the way it should be. You know, no. knifs, not knives. Knifs. Some people are just gonna be like, "You damn dumb girl! You're supposed to say it the way it's supposed to be." Well, we say it how we want to. I mean, if you guys are gonna come up with a dumb word, hey, let's come up with a dumb word. Swag. Now that's just dumb. Ours is funny as hell. Why? He got connected. I swear. I think I think Kniff is better than swag. Any day. I'm gonna Kniff ya. A word of caution, little one. Wait until you grow big, <laughs> like me, before charging those large enemies. What are your big muscles compensating for? Oh, his small horns. Got it. Yes, tiny horn. Ah, those bats are creepy. And I heard that they're uh poisonous? Something like that? I don't know, but you could die off of a bat. <laughs> That's what I heard. But I don't know if it's true or not, but yeah. What a survival thing. You know, a little survival thing that I read one day. And it's actually pretty funny, but you can't believe what some books say. Without, you know, proper facts, but... One of them said, because, you know, I was looking at sharks, and... And I was reading... What to do when a shark... When a shark attacks you? You punch it in the nose. Psst. Spyro! Some big norks up ahead are wearing armor. And in the ice cave, armor can make their feet very slippery. Hmm... <laughs> Slippery. Alright, but yeah, you're supposed to sh punch a shark in a nose. <laughs> Hell no. And then this other book was saying, don't punch it in the nose, that just aggravates them. Uh. Excuse me. Uh. Oh my god! Well, hey, Nintendo Capri Sun does it, so why can't a girl? Oh yeah, just because I'm a woman. Oh my god, 369s. That's why! Oh, jerks! Always giving me the 69. <sighs> oh well. Alright, so we're just gonna skip our way back because mm, only the only the most powerful people can skip. Oh wait, wait, wait. This damn little emerald. I mean <gasps> emerald gem. Whatever. Ruby, there we go. Oh yeah, back to the shark thing. You're supposed to punch it in its eyes or its gills for it to, you know, uh, for you to let go. Also, the more you struggle, of course, the more you're gonna bleed out because a uh, shark's mouth is basically four lines, four to three lines of razor sharp teeth, and the more you just move, the easier it is for your blood to go into their system, and then they can eat you, and then they will. It's delicious, and there you go. And there you go. Alright, I'm gonna go reply to him real quick. My friend. Hey there. I guess I should have put in a recording. Do not disturb. 
think I'm only ha I think I'm only gonna have two guests. Uh, Kevin and Vinny. Or Vinners, as I call them. That's what this guy does. Nope, he's gonna moon me. I'll kill- I'll kill your commander! Quit being a pussy! <laughs> nope. Nope. I'm trying to get them to do that one thing. Uh, I'm really- Oh, come on! Can these guys just do it already? Wait! Here it is! Fine. Nice ass. I'm feeling a bit horny. <laughs> uh, bad joke, I know. Alright, I guess that leaves us with only one more level to do. Well, not one more level, but I think one more task. Yeah, yeah, just one more task. Just three levels and then the boss battle. Or boss stage, I guess. I guess I could do that right now. I'll just do it right now. Oh, stop having 30 thoughts, boys. Seriously, boys, because us ladies, we barely have those, but... We have those guys who are just straight up... Oh my gosh, she said that. Oh, she wants it. <laughs> That's how you boys are. You're like, oh my gosh, did she say she wanted it? Mm, that's what she said. <laughs> uh, that's how you boys are. Alright, this guy is supposed to be a guard, but yet, yeah, look. I can easily just, you know, walk by, but... I'm gonna kill him. No one will remember you. Why? Because you took gems! Ah, oh, man. That civil war is very sad to me. But then again, it is true about what this one quote on Call of Duty just came up. It said, All wars are civil wars because all men are brothers. I find that I do believe that actually. Well done, Spyro. Keep up the good work, and I know you'll fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some. Just toast those enemies and collect the treasure. That is my favorite dragon on this world, Gunner. Why? Because that's the sergeant right there, or the commander. What are we gonna do? Well, I'll tell you something. We're gonna go in and kick their asses. Yeah. Yeah, he, he's my favorite dragon. He's mine. Oh boy, this is child abuse. And that's just called fucking around. Take that. Poor guy. Oh my gosh. You know what? I'm gonna be really mean. I'm gonna I'm gonna not charge at them. I'm not gonna charge them. It's amazing that they both fell off, off fell off the same cliff. Oh my god, I love this song. I I can really put I could really put this in a party and then people would be dancing. <laughs> oh my! Alright. Well, your brothers died. So yeah. Fun out. Oh crap, I forgot you can't get healed in here. Oh no! Oh man, where are my friends? They said, if you ever break up, you're gonna be like, No! I said, no, I would be sad, but now I'm one of my friends. But then my other friend, like my BFF forever, he's like, I bet you're gonna cry, then you're going to find another guy. Uh, 
That's all you freaking put something different! There we go. 25 gems. Oh boy, I can't wait for the next semester. I'm gonna hang out with my friends and then I'm gonna leave from my college. Well, my university, anyways. This guy thinks he's so cool. You don't know what it's been like listening to him over and over. But I'll tell you one thing he should watch his back. That guy looks like a bully. I'm not gonna lie, he has, he has you know, the bully luck. This is my favorite boss. Oh, look at that boy. Alright, first one just... <laughs> That's why I love him! I guess I should record. Guess I should record a lot of Spyro then. If you guys really, oh, oh darn it. <laughs> okay, so that concludes this episode. And next time we will be doing the, we'll be finishing up this level, going over to Magic Crafters, and doing that level over there. All right, ciao.